Hello, Leo, and welcome to the Matches or the Fire Group uh, for your card reading for October 2021. I want to mention here the Fire Group is alone. The other three groups uh, are in a separate video because I had some technical difficulties. So please uh, watch the other uh, three videos uh, for Leo also for October. You can find them on my channel. They are very detailed also. Um, anyway, starting and coming to the card reading, uh, and I want to mention before something before I start the reading, uh, on 27 September, Mercury started running retrograde. This is up to 18 October, meaning it's not a good time for signing contracts, agreements, anything you need to put your name under, and that officialize it, it's not a good thing to do. Also, during that period, you will see that... Um, your train is delayed, your flight is cancelled, emails that you need to receive are not showing up and they have consequences. Um, you're more in traffic jams. These are all things that are happening very frequently during Mercury retrograde. It's because our mind, the mind of all people, the collective mind is running a little bit slower. Also in that period, it's not a good idea, for instance, for buying laptops, cell phones, laundry machines, why these devices are connected um, to a contract and the contract is connected to the warranty and sometimes problems pop up later on. Anyway, the general idea here is that we don't sign any contracts whatsoever. If for some reason you are obligated, you are compelled, you have no choice or you want to sign a contract, please double, triple check the fine print because it's possible after you change your mind, you want to get out of the contract and you cannot anymore or there are some clauses in the contract that are binding and you are unable to change those binding clauses. Anyway, please uh, prevent and uh, try to avoid contracts during that period. This being said, now we start with the card reading for Leo for the Fire Group for October 2021. As the first card here in the corner, we see the mice. Um, meaning probably you're in a period uh, that you are uh, suffering certain losses in your life and certain difficulties are connected to those losses. Um, maybe you're experiencing some issues. Um, it's, prob it's possible that some things in your life are not working out as you expected. Uh, maybe this, this is related to certain persons close to you, persons in charge, authority figures. Uh, maybe it's related to abroad. So it's possible here that you're experiencing some losses or some difficulties in that area. Um, it means also that um, maybe we things are working out in a different way than we anticipated or that we thought that they would be that they would work out. Um, anyway, even if you are in a difficult period here, the, the middle card, the the mountain, it's telling us to be strong. To uh, even if we are suffering a difficult period, we are experiencing uh, problems with authorities, with crossing borders, with abroad. We need to try to stand our ground. Um, and we need to focus here on our goals, be determinative, even if it's very difficult for us to move or uh, maybe we are not able to move on. But we need to be strong here during this problem. We need to be uh, we need to show some toughness to resolve this here. This is what we see with this combination. Anyway, now we go to the portrait itself. We start with the horizontal lines. Here, the first card here, we see here that there are some uh, regrets. We are dwelling on the past. Uh, maybe some things we have difficulties to let go on. We are unable to let go of certain things. Um, maybe um, we should focus ourselves more on time issues, that time is important. Uh, time don't st stand still for no man or woman. Uh, so this is what we see here also. If certain goals in your life um, are difficult to reach. Uh, anyway, try to move, try to uh, keep a certain structure so you can still slowly grow, even though it's difficult and um, it's not easy to move for the moment. I know the, the message is a little bit contradictive, but uh, you will know what I understand. Don't try to waste your time. Um, if you are interested in certain topics of your life, try to focus uh, try to focus on them and still try to get some movement, maybe gather information for still moving on um, so you can progress. It's the, the message here is that we cannot waste our time here. Um, anyway, um, 
it could be possible also that some people around us with this combination, they are not what they seem to be. Maybe authority figures, father figures around us are dishonest to us. Uh, maybe some uh, government uh, institutions around us are not uh, are not very honest. In some cases, it could lead uh, Kunming, also corruption. This is what we see here. Um, and it's possible because there are difficulties uh, with these authority figures, father figures, people in charge, that we are that we are not so um, that our energy towards them is dwindling. We are not so focused anymore because we um, we experience these difficulties. Um, anyway, here uh, it's also can point that we are suffering some loneliness in our life. We are alone for the moment. Um, it's possible maybe that these people here in charge, they try to, in a way, to damage your reputation. This is possible also. Um, here, um, uh, then we come in the second here, we have the tower and the tree in itself. Um, even though it's difficult now, maybe your uh, eventual uh, goal uh, is related to another city or to abroad because we have the ship here. So the ship in general means travel. We are traveling, goods are traveling, money are traveling, or we are considering a career in abroad or doing some business in abroad. Here, coming back to these two cards here, uh, this means that uh, on the long run, maybe for this month, it's a little bit, uh, everything is a little bit slowed down now. Um, but here, uh, on the long run, if you stay focused, things will uh, work out well. Um, maybe for now, because you feel a little bit less energetic, you need to rest more. Um, and if you have the energy, you need to focus on the things that you really like. It's also possible that you are planning to meditate, to, uh, to meditate here, to, um, to seclude yourself a little bit more because the tower is alone. You like to be alone more for, for, uh, for keeping your mind on track. In some cases, it could also point um, that for elevating or for relaxing our mind, sometimes we use uh, substances like uh, marijuana. This is what we see here also with this combination. Um, anyway, this points also to an isolation. It's possible that we are uh, in going in meditation or uh, we are focusing on, on walks in nature. We are enjoying nature. We feel we want to connect with nature for relaxing our mind here. This is what we see. This is, um, this is also points to a, a period that we want to be alone also here. Um, it's possible also that some bureaucracies um, are uh, stunting you that you cannot advance because of bureaucracies or people in charge. This is uh, what we, we see. And that may, might be the reason why we cannot move on with our plans. But um, this will all work out. We have, the, we have the, um, the cross here. And the cross is a card that um, it, it, it prevents us from things happening uh, before it's time. So it means if in a certain situation you cannot move or you are unable to move, as in this combination, uh, the cross put an additional stop to it. This means, this is the card of time, that you, that you cannot move before the situation is in your own advantage. It's annoying uh, that you are stopped and they can, that you cannot move, but it's for your own good. You will see later on and then you will think, Oh, it's good. I didn't do this or that because now it's the time to move. You will see later on when it's the right time to move. This card is a burden, but it's also a protection. So it, it has a, a it has a double feature. Um, anyway, coming back here, um, it's possible also if you want to travel certain borders, cross certain borders. This is difficulties. It's possible uh, if you uh, want to cross borders or you want to go in other countries that you are confronted there um, with corrupt authority figures. Uh, there, they are not honest to you. Maybe they want something from you because sometimes the, the mice want something. In some countries where we travel uh, travel to, especially uh, in abroad, um, there are countries that are still cor corrupt, and uh, a lot of countries. So maybe we come in a country that there is some uh, corrupt border uh, controls there. And this is what we see here also um, with this combination. Anyway, this can also point to a religious institution where we, uh, where we retreat ourselves. Um, in another way, um, 
we could be confronted with taxes with the government here. Uh, this is uh, possible also. Uh, in another way, this is a positive thing, but it's on the long run. I'm going to say here these two cards. Um, this means that um, if you are in the middle or early stages of your career, that um, people with this combination on the long run means that uh, later on in life, between 60 and 75, I know for some of you it will uh, uh, be far, but uh, this combination means that later on in life we uh, are successful. And in, in the long run, this means between 60 and 75. I want to uh, mention this. Uh, if you are focused on the long run, this means career on an older age. Anyway, uh, this can also point that you connect to some spiritualism, that uh, there is a, a person that uh, brings you in uh, higher spheres or teaches you to hire, uh, to bring in higher spheres by meditation. Maybe this is what it, uh, we also see here also. Uh, it's possible also that you want to learn something from an authority figure from, uh, but I mean uh, here then in a spiritual way, this is what we see here also. Uh, it's possible if you uh, go in these meditations, there are uh, requirements. Uh, for instance, you need to follow certain food regimes. This is what we see here also. And you follow these um, uh, regimes for bringing you in uh, an, an, another level maybe of meditation. This is what we see here also um, with this combination. Then we come in the coffin, uh, the mountain um, and the ship. Um, <clears throat> here we can see the, the coffin is a standstill. Uh, we cannot we cannot move uh, the, the coffin is a is a quiet a card that is uh, actually that it's like a, a poly, um, like a psychological blockage here we are undergoing some transformations in our life and we are unable to move we need to digest this situation here before we can move on and then we have the mountain next to it so we are actually blocked now we cannot move and then we have the cross there so you see this is not an easy situation but it's also a situation where we will learn from uh, this combination so anyway, here there's an obstacle. We cannot move on with this situation. Um, if we want to move in abroad, it might be difficult to move. And maybe if we come there, things are not as we expected and we are confronted with certain problems there, as we mentioned earlier. Anyway, this points again to that we feel alone. We want to be alone. Maybe it's best to be alone here with this combination. Um, if you have experiences some health issues because you cannot move on, try to eat healthy, see you have sufficient vitamins, minerals, uh, all these things. So take care of your health here also with this combination. Uh, anyway, there could be some grief here also, some sadness because the coffin sometimes brings the sadness because we cannot move on because we are in a difficult situation. Uh, this is possible. Also, we could feel that it puts a very big weight on us because the mountain is heavy. It puts a weight on us. Um, and we are in, unable to move or go through with certain uh, plans that we have. Maybe we have certain longings for going abroad here. Uh, this is possible with this combination because these two cards are actually uh, pointing to abroad and the tower is crossing the border. So you see all these cards are uh, pointing to abroad, pointing to changes, pointing to another city. This is what we see here with this combination. Um, Eventually, then you will break the silence. Uh, maybe this is uh, this process already going on for a while. And by the end of the month, you might be uh, moving uh, already a little bit. But as I said, when the cross is here, uh, it will only be allowed when it's the right time. Um, anyway, it could also point that you don't show your grief to others, that you take it inside of you, that you don't come out with it. This is what we see also with this combination. Then we have the mountain and the ship in abroad, maybe on the when this whole waiting period and uh, uh, crossing borders problems are finished, you are able to move on here then. Um, it's possible that you are um, thinking about um, doing some business in abroad. But if we do some business in abroad, we need to pay attention to details because the mice is details. So if we go in some form of business, we will need to pay attention to a lot of details, uh, maybe especially um, a lot, uh, or we need to pay attention to things regarding authorities. We need to see that we have all the right licenses because else if we hadn't, have not, it could block us. This is what we see here also with this combination. Uh, anyway, uh, here uh, you we can see that the trip is delayed, but it's coming, it's coming in the future. We could be a little bit uh, frustrated uh, about it here. Um, 
and it will happen in abroad as we saw earlier here um, but maybe it's not possible uh, for now here maybe you're planning to do some business in abroad the, this could be um, if if this is a business and i need to make some ideas here uh, this could be like a heavy business uh, things with heavy things uh, with things that restrict also that we see here it could also literally be that we are working with stones gravel uh, valuable stones here this is what we see here with this combination or anything that works with a heavy or a stone or fixed materials hard materials here business with hard materials this is what we see here also heavy and hard um, materials here um, what we see here more um, if you are traveling probably uh, it's possible that you have maybe you travel alone because the mountain is alone and you experience some feelings of loneliness uh, during your travel this is what we see here also, uh, anyway, this points to after a long of period of waiting, you will be finally allowed or you will be finally able to move on uh, because before there were maybe no uh, physical or you could not physically move here with this combination. Um, anyway, we will accept our grief. We will accept uh, the things that we, we, we are uh, into. Um, it's possible also here also maybe it's best to uh, if we are going in some form of business we inquire a lot about that we we gather a lot of information we prepare ourselves uh, mentally uh, for this business this is uh, possible here also with this combination um, um, putting here we see also that you put all your eggs in a basket here together this is what we see here also um, you have itchy feet but you cannot move um, then we have the birds the letter and uh, the cross um, what we see here uh, there are there is a lot of communication the the letter is not superficial communication this is an important document it's like a deed a degree something that we can transfer in money for instance for instance our degree we can transfer if we find a job in money so this is the chain the same this is a, a bond or uh, it could literally be money so there's a lot of thoughts here about money here we communicate a lot about money uh, it could also mean there is some stress issues regarding money here because the, the birds are nervous so there's some stress here about um, uh, money here it's possible also that we share because this is the internet also i forgot to mention it this points to the internet it's possible also that um, we share or we search for a lot of information on the internet you're passing on a message you share things on social media uh, maybe this is um heavy news because the cross is heavy it's serious news it's uh, or you search for things that can improve your career on the long run this is what we see here also it's possible also that you are confronted with some um, gossip or uh, or stressful message uh, annoying messages this is what we see here also the situation because you cannot move could be a little bit hectic here um anyway there will be moments that uh, you will be able to move quickly after this period of waiting is um, is passed uh, here then, uh, before, uh, when this waiting period is over, um, here we see that uh, important use, again, the cross is, it makes things very important, it's an important step, uh, is coming to us and this message will guide us to where we need to, where we need to be. Um, the, the news will be heavy. Maybe there's a painful element to it. Maybe it's painful to leave. This is what we see here also. Uh, the news is difficult, but it's meant to be its fate. Um, also, the, this communication will be regular. Um, you will maybe start uh, change certain standards in your life. This is what we see here. Um, anyway, the communication could also have a heart uh, factor because the mountain is hard like hard news is coming to us uh, it's possible here that we uh, communicate we saw earlier there uh, meditation and religion and spirituality it's possible also that we communicate in a serious way about spirituality 
um, it's possible that we reach certain levels here in spirituality, because this points like a degree in spirituality, a certain level in spirituality, a next step in spirituality or in religion. This is what we see here also. Anyway, there's a lot of communication about uh, uh, all these things here. Um, it's like an expression of pain that we are uh, doing here. Then we have the mice, um, the coffin and the birds. Um, here it points to that we are confronted with certain disappointments. Probably this is a, a disappointment because we cannot uh, move on here. Um, there's an end of something. It's like a metaphorical that here there's a lot of psychological uh, changes uh, going on in our mind. Um, this could mean, being, mean that we talk less, we talk a lot less, we communicate less. Uh, especially if we are in the retreat area, but still there's a lot of information searching here. Uh, it's a little bit a contradictive laying, I know, but this is how it is here with this combination. Um, anyway, um, what we see here more, um, sometimes, as I said earlier, we need to take care, care of our health. We need to see that, uh, that we uh, eat sufficient, eat healthy, even though the situation is blocking us. It's not easy. It works on our mind or our, on our psychology. We need to see here that we are, um, that, and also we need to take sufficient rest. Uh, if things make us very stressed out, uh, the meditation here may be a very big help here, or the quietness, or uh, going to some places of religion. Uh, this could mean a big help for us because in general, in these places, there is quietness. Uh, so it could be a help, a help for us here. Uh, resting here and time off here uh, could be a big help for us as a, as a person. Um, um, anyway, you will feel here that the end is coming. Um, it's coming slowly because the mice are bit by bit, slowly, bite by bite, bit by bit. The, the end is coming here. This is what we see here. And it could drain you a little bit. It, it could drain you because the situation is not moving here. Um, and also here, we are literally seeing that we are preparing our, uh, our mind for saying goodbye to certain people in our lives. Then we come uh, in the coffin and the birds in itself. Um, here, it's possible also that um, with this combination that again, that, uh, that we are in certain topics, but we stole the communication about certain topics. Um, it's possible that you didn't speak with certain people in your life for a long time because the mountain is a long time uh, and the mountain, it, uh, it blocks. So it's possible here uh, in a period of your life before that you didn't speak to a person for a very long time. Um, maybe you now start to communicate, but this is possible that this is a communication about an end. This, you communicate here about an end. Uh, maybe you're de communicating with this person again about your departure. This is possible here, so it's like, um, a, courteous, a courteous information that you give to the person. It's not really that you uh, will engage with this person on the long run. This is more like a uh, goodbye here uh, that we are saying um, uh, with this combination. Um, yeah, we see again here the stress levels that we are seeing, uh, maybe some moments. Uh, you feel like it's time, like you feel like a ghost, you literally want to disappear. Um, you are irritated about, uh, about some, uh, some things in your life. Um, it's possible that you communicated before with certain peoples on, people on media accounts and that you do no longer want to communicate with these people. Maybe they no longer fit your goal, your butt, what you want, and you, uh, you you move away from them. This is what we see here also. Um, also, it's possible that you feel less agile for the moment, less uh, flexible. Um, this is what we see here also. Anyway, this is a difficult situation that we are about to end. Also, we are probably sometimes having uh, memories. Um, we see uh, clearly if something happens to us in the past, we now see what this has brought to us. It's like these moments give us uh, the, Memories give us a clear view on the situation that is happening now. This is what we see. We could get some inspiration about uh, this. 
sometimes it might be shocking. The, 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 we see something, we dream, some, dream something, we daydream about something, we reflect about something, and sometimes, sometimes it becomes suddenly clear to us. And in a way, we, it shocks us. It shocks us because we see the real truth behind the things here uh, that we are seeing. It's possible in the area where you're living uh, that you also experience some uh, um, bad weather conditions. This is what we see here also with this, uh, with this combination. Also, you will be on your tiptoes, not for, for trying not to be manipulated here. This is what we see here also with this combination. Um, it's difficult for us to stay still here, but still we are forced to stay still. We see this here again. Um, there's a letting go here, um, and uh, you will need to let some things go irreversible because the coffin is irreversible. We let go of certain things and these things will never happen again. We have our experience and we move on. Then we come in the tower, the mountain and the letter. Um, uh, this is uh, difficulties out of the past that might be coming back to us. Again, we see the same here. We learn about it. We learn to set, set some, certain limits because we learn things out of the past. This is what we see here. Um, anyway, it's possible that you stand alone. You need to take care of yourself. This is what we see here also with this combination. It's possible that you are challenged by certain people, by certain authorities. This is what we see here, difficult obstacles that are coming in our way. Um, maybe there are difficulties in abroad. This is what we see here. So we cannot uh, see, we cannot do this travel before it's the right, right time, because if we would move or would able to move before it's time, we would be confronted with uh, very difficult problems. So it's best to travel when the time is right. And this will be a slow process, but a short process once you're on the run, uh, when you're, once you're on the go, sorry. Um, anyway, this points to a place in the past. It's possible that we get information, that we get important documents from abroad, from a place in the past. This is what we see here with this combination. We could have sometimes hard, uh, hard, uh, a hard time because we are always alone. Maybe we write it down that we feel alone. This is possible also with this combination. There's like an emotional silence here. Uh, we have actually need for some fresh air for some walks in the forest. This is what we see here. Um, and it's possible if you would like to, like for instance, force a trip that the answer that you get is a clear no. This is what we see here. Then we have the mountain and, uh, and uh, the letter here. Uh, this is uh, that we see here with this combination. This is news that we are receiving from uh, a foreigner or something abroad. This news is important. Uh, it, has, uh, it could have heavy consequences. Um, and it's possible also that you communicate about certain structures in abroad. This is what we see here also with this uh, combination. The message that you will be receiving uh, will be something that you waited on for a very long time, but it finally arrives, um, this message. Um, and also this means that uh, when this period of waiting is finally passed, you will receive, because this can point to a visa, you will finally be allowed to travel. This could mean a visa also, uh, this combination. Um, anyway, we see here that we finally uh, move on and that we finally see the problems as they are here. We finally address the elephant in the room. Uh, then we have the, the tree, um, the ship and the cross. Um, here we see that um, certain events, so when it's the time, events unfold unfold exactly as we desire. When it's the time, the, the events unfold exactly as we uh, desire. There will be healthy progress here. This is what we see here. You will be able more to find pieces of yourself uh, and put yourself together here and grow slowly in the path that is meant to be. Probably as we see here, it has to do with abroad as we always, uh, or in another city if you're not uh, the far distant travel. But mostly this is all combinations for going abroad. Um, 
anyway, this points again to uh, meditation, that we are on a spiritual journey, if you're in that kind of stuff. Um, here, this is points to shamanism, spiritualism, meditation. This is all what we see here also. We could take a spiritual trip um, if in another city then, maybe there's some person there who was able to educate us in spirituality or in uh, shamanism or, or in meditation. This is what we see here with this uh, combination. Um, there's a strong desire here for growing here. That is what we see here. You will make certain changes in your life that uh, that you will want to become more stable. You will become more grounded in those fields of health meditation. It will give you more uh, a foothold here uh, if you do so. Um, it's a little bit an odd thing to say, but the meditation here can really give you a foothold because meditation is actual uh, elevation, but in a way, it gives you a foothold. This is what we see here with this combination. Also, you will uh, make uh, certain establishments with uh, foreigners or people in abroad. This is um, what we see here. Also, you will have a, a person who teaches you something. You will have great appreciation for this master because the cross can be the master. Um, um, it's possible also um, that you are uh, need to undergo some tests. You are tested here um, in certain limits and limitation, but there is a growth here. There is a growth. We search for our roots. We go deeper. Um, also, we will be pragmatic here in this uh, combination. We want to get deeply rooted. We want to develop ourselves slowly in the path when we are where we are going. Um, possibly in abroad or in our spiritual journey. Then we have um, the ship and uh, the cross. This means that uh, we reach our destination uh, here, uh, that where we want to be. It's a destined trip. We need to go there. Um, uh, or we are meant to go there. We are exploring certain ideologies, or maybe we are traveling for ideologies, for spirituality, as we saw to another city or another country. This come back here. This combination is like a pilgrimage here that we see, a pilgrimage that is uh, mentioned here. With this combination, we go where uh, fate leads us. We go on a quest. Uh, there could be that uh, we are confronted with spiritual suffering here this is what we see here but this suffering in a way it elevates us also it brings us further in our path of life or where we need to go we take responsibility for uh, our journey it's a faithful journey you will commit to certain principles uh, you will find it your duty to do sit to do this um this also then sometimes it points to emigration here that we see here or changing city. Um, and anyway, this journey is very important for you. It has a very big influence on you and you waited for this for a very uh, long time. Then the cross here, um, we, the cross, uh, we have the mice, um, the mountain and the cross. Um, here we see that... Uh, Again, we see there's a lot of uh, misses, uh, efforts necessary to move on. Um, the obstacles that you are facing right now take a lot of energy from you. It's like something is gnawed away from you, nibbled away here. Um, it's possible also with this combination, you lose weight. You lose weight. That's why I say you need to uh, eat healthy here if you lose weight because of the stress, uh, because of uh, some draining situations in your life then we have the mountain and the cross and itself um, you will overcome these obstacles on the long run um, what we see here more um, we see the solid solitude again and we are uh, confronted with certain responsibilities that we will be obligated to take on or we obligatively take them on. This is what we see here uh, with this combination. There will be certain blockages that you need to overcome, overgrow. Here, this is what we see here. Um, sometimes you will be uh, challenged by fate for moving on. This is what we see here also. Um, then we have um, the tree, the mountain, and the birds. Um, 
again here we see the positive ending here the things end in a positive way uh, your health will improve also then once you're uh, able to move on it has a positive effect on you um, you will be slowly healing uh, of, of the things that blocked you for so long and from the people that you said goodbye to this is what we see here also with this combination uh, don't be hesitant, finally move on. It's the time then uh, to move on after this long period of difficulties. Um, you will move a long distance because this is long distance here, this combination. Um, if you are moving to another city, maybe this moving to another city even is a big step for you in a way, uh, but possibly this is abroad. Um, it's also um, that you spiritually travel here. We, again, we see this spiritual travel here in our mind uh, on, a, on an other level, on a higher level. Um, anyway, there will be, if you uh, undergo all these transformations after, you will experience a deep satisfaction here. Um, there will come a way out for you here. Uh, you will accept certain things out of your life, out of the past. You will set them give them a place in your life. This is what, uh, what, what we see here. You will keep persisting for going where you want to go. Um, some things in your life maybe are difficult to change. So you will tolerate them. You will tolerate them, but you will give them a place. You will put them in a certain areas of your life. You will tolerate them. If you cannot take them out, you will tolerate them. This is what we see here also with this combination. Um, there's a slow energy growth here. Um, it's possible that you are literally in a retreat in the mountains, literally in the mountains, in a high area. This is possible also. It will be quiet there, maybe a place in abroad. Again, we see this here. Uh, then we have the mountain and the birds here again. And there's a lot of communication in abroad. We see this here. Um, we need to see that we have all the right documents because now just see that you have all your documents in place, that you inquire, call embassies, call uh, my immigration, that you see that you have all the right documents because if you don't have, it might cause problems because it's difficult now to travel. Uh, every country is different. Every country has its own rules, regulation with this uh, virus thing. So we need to see that we have all the right documents. Uh, inform uh, every day about your travel. Uh, if there is an update of certain rules and re regulations that you are aware of these rules and regulations because else you could be confronted with um, difficulties that you don't actually want. Sometimes governments now change every month their policy of immigration so see that you are a cur of this situation and that you are not blocked because you don't have the right documents uh, during your travel and that you are not challenged uh, there uh, with documents you could have easy way. Um, so, um, Leo, for the fire group, this is all for this month. I hope you enjoyed this card reading uh, or that you get a little bit wiser with this card reading. If you did, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for doing so. Um, if this video don't fit you at all, please check out the other three videos that are connected uh, here on my channel. They are separate. There are three. They are in another video because I had some technical difficulties here. Anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, thank you for your time on my channel. And we see each other soon on my other videos. Thank you. Bye-bye for now.